Hey everyone, welcome to another episode of our podcast. Today we're diving into the fascinating world of wireless testing and security with a special focus on a new firmware called Ghost ESP, designed specifically for the popular ESP32 microcontroller. So let's kick things off by talking about what Ghost ESP actually is. Essentially, it's a robust firmware that transforms your ESP32 into a powerhouse for conducting wireless network exploration and security testing. Just imagine being able to deeply analyze Wi-Fi and Bluetooth low energy, or BLE, devices right from your fingertips. Sounds cool, right? Now here's something intriguing to consider. How many networks do you think are around you at any given moment? Ghost ESP has a feature for Wi-Fi access point scanning. This allows users to detect and display all nearby Wi-Fi networks, giving you detailed visibility into your wireless environment. It's like being a superhero of your own network, seeing all the hidden connections and devices that are usually obscured from view. And speaking of devices, have you ever wondered who's connected to your home Wi-Fi? With Ghost ESP's station scanning feature, you can identify and monitor the Wi-Fi stations or clients that are connected to your local networks. This insight into active devices is essential for anyone serious about maintaining their network's integrity. But wait, there's even more. It includes a feature called Beacon Spam. Sounds quite mischievous, doesn't it? Here, you can deploy SSID beacons, essentially little signals that can simulate or disrupt network environments. Picture this. If you're testing a network, being able to cause a little chaos to assess defenses. Just remember, this should always be done ethically. Now let's talk about perhaps the most notable feature, deauthentication attacks. I can hear you asking, what's that? Simply put, it's a technique to disconnect clients from Wi-Fi networks. This can be a vital part of testing network security to see how weak links might respond under pressure. Ghost ESP isn't just limited to Wi-Fi, it also packs a punch with BLE scanning capabilities. This means you can scan for BLE devices, including some pretty popular ones like AirTags and Flipper Zeros. And while the firmware is still in beta for certain functionalities, it's exciting to think about the future updates coming our way. The firmware supports various ESESP32 models, so if you've got a room S2, C3, or even an S3, you're covered. However, there's a little caveat for users of the ESP32 C6 as it has partial support. It's always advice to check compatibility before diving in. Now I have to highlight a crucial aspect, the legal implications. Ghost ESP is designed for educational purposes and ethical security research. This means always getting proper authorization before you embark on any wireless security tests. We've all heard the saying, with great power comes great responsibility. And this is truly applicable here. As we wrap up this discussion on Ghost ESP, let's reflect on the key takeaways. It's a powerful tool for wireless network exploration. It offers various advanced features for both Wi-Fi and BLE, and it encourages responsible usage. Think of it as your gateway to becoming a wireless networking wizard, but only if you're playing by the rules. So if you're curious about diving deeper into the world of wireless security and testing, Ghost ESP could be your ticket. And as we sign off today, I encourage you to explore your surroundings. What networks are hiding in plain sight around you? Until next time, stay curious and ethical in your tech explorations.